I'm Randy, the bad boy. <laughs> dress up, dress up, cause now you're in the fashion show. Hey, Lynn Maggio here in the Jugnu studio at South by Southwest Interactive. And right now I have Mimi and Wayne White here with us. And I am so excited to be talking to you right now. I watched your documentary and it's so exciting. So I think you're like one of the top, in the top to, to win. And I think you certainly have a great shot. Very entertaining. Oh, thank you very much. It's great to be here. Thank you so much. I love your outlook on life. Um, one of the things that I do recall you saying in your documentary was, you know, if we're lucky, at the most, we have 80 to 90 good years, right? So make it happen. And right. I think you've done that. Tell us a little bit about what you've done. Well, um, I started out as a painter in uh, Tennessee. I went to art school. and But I uh, graduated and became a cartoonist and moved to New York City. And that, that's why I moved to New York to be a cartoonist. I was a cartoonist and illustrator there for three or four years. And then I'd been doing a puppet show on the side just for fun. But lo and behold, that wound up as a career choice for me. And I got a job on Pee Wee's Playhouse as a puppet designer and a set designer and as a performer. Yeah, I'm Randy, the bad boy. <laughs> so um, I got into showbiz in 1986 after being an illustrator and cartoonist and worked in uh, kids' television for 30 years. I did Beekman's World, uh, Shining Time Station. Riders in the Sky, did um, the Smashing Pumpkins video tonight, tonight, and um, uh, Peter Gabriel's video, Big Time. So I've been in television a long time, but about 12 years ago, I got back into the fine art world as a painter, what I originally started out as, and I do what I call word paintings, which I'm best known for. And so I've done a little bit of everything in the art world, I guess. That's exciting, and Mimi has been such a great support system for you. And I love the, the dynamic relationship you have and that is expressed in your documentary. I have a passion for the fun of things that sweeten this world, but it's the sweetest sin that pulls us all like diamonds and 